<laughs> we won. The replay's dead, so we can't replay cast it. The reason it wasn't uh, the reason it wasn't casted was because KC thought that we were cheating, so Pyromuffin was not allowed to be in the stream. Sorry, in the game, because that would be a potential cheating. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, cack. Uh, if you give the mid guy a fucking bloodlust, yeah, I swear to God. I like what? All I heard there was a bunch of curse words and I don't really know what he said. He said Ihia and something else. <laughs> Fuck. I can't believe Doctor that was played every game has been played so little since the nerfs. Not something that you would think. Go, go, go. I go, I come, อ่าขอมิดมิดล่ะโอ้ยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบยุบย
Should have heard it. Uh, I don't know how many more games we have to win to qualify, like I said. All I know, to be top two in, the, in, in this qualifier, we have to win three more. Well, two more. But in order to place first place, we need to win three more. As for uh, qualifying to the World Finals, I don't know. Oh fuck yeah, my god, this dude. My goddamn roommate stole the PlayStation now, so I don't, I can't play <coughs> Horizon Zero Dawn. I was gonna play Horizon Zero Dawn all night today. Finish the game. Let's do like a late night, yeah, really late night stream. And he's like, oh yeah, I'm going to Chiang Mai and I'm taking the PlayStation with me. What the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit, that was a fast TP, like I barely even moved before he TP'd. Jesus Christ. <laughs> You're not going out on Friday? Yeah, I don't feel like it. I'm still not feeling too well. And, uh, yeah. no, not going out. Hey, ward, 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 ward. Oh fuck, I misclicked. That is very bad. That was a free kill. Shit. I may still be able to do it if I just run all the way. Fuck, that was so dumb. God damn it. That was a massive free kill. มันน่าจะถอดแล้วแหละถอดแล้วเดี๋ยวบอลมันแบบอย่าพี่เอาไปเราไปหกไปเนี่ยตายแล้วมาแข่งกันในป่าวะเอาไปเฮียอยู่
I don't know if there's going to be like a land qualifier for those four teams or whatever happens. All I know is that only two teams are going. And two teams have one are in the first qualifier and two teams in this qualifier. And then those four needs to be reduced to two. And how they're going to do that, I don't know. So. Yeah. So in order for us to get to the next stage, we only have to place top two. But I assume it's going to be something like the winner of the first uh, qualifier will meet the loser of the second qualifier. So you still want to win your qualifier, you know? But I don't know. I didn't ask Arena for some fucking reason. I could have just asked him. Ah, <laughs> yet <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh. More, 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 more. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Okay, oh shit, I'm playing pretty good this game. Very good. Very good. Ah, go for it, Cap. Dimak, Dimak. Mmm, shy. Shy. They're so like fucking amazed that I'm speaking one word of Thai. <laughs> it's like fucking ridiculous. <laughs> My share, my tower. My. Word, I think. Uh, Monday is next game. We don't play on weekends here. Which is very nice for someone like me who goes out a lot on weekends. It allows you to have a life on the weekends. So I like it. A lot more busy week. Than <laughs> many EU, but overall better than <laughs> yeah, I know, I'm buying all clones all the time now. Before I came to Thailand, there was no all clones. Now it's in every game. <laughs> Sorry, stream. I don't like it. Trust me. But it's what my team wants me to buy. I'm pretty much every hero. So I better get used to it. That's why I'm just buying it on every hero to see like how much of an impact it actually does. Besides boosting your GPM. Like I'll be completely honest here. I think the the main reason for Thai players buying Aukbones is because you have a higher GPM number on paper. When it as a matter of fact, it lowers your GPM the first few minutes because you're wasting gold, technically. It doesn't raise your GPM until later, but your number is always higher than without an Aukbones. And I honestly think that's why a lot of them like buy it. I may be wrong, but I just have a feeling that one of the major reasons for them buying bones is that it looks prettier. Oh. Oh, you fucked up. You can see I walk. Holy fuck I'm alive. Oh, what mark team? <laughs> Damn. I did not expect to survive that. My name was fucked up. And Marius is not available in the competitive room. Yes. I mean, obviously, the experience increase is a big factor, especially on heroes that relies on the, uh, like, relies on experience. But I do think one of the main reasons for them buying it is also that it looks prettier on the number. But yeah, most of my teammates have mentioned the fact that they go Aukbones is for, to get earlier, higher levels. I mean, I'm sure it's individual, or it's just follow John nowadays, I don't know. Who knows, really. At the end of the day, as long as it's working out, who cares, right? But I mean, if you if you can get four Ock Bones on your team really early, so four heroes has an experience boost, and obviously it's going to have a major impact, because ten minutes later, well, more than ten minutes, but a few minutes later, they'll have uh, they'll have recovered all the gold they lost, 
and you'll be way higher levels than the enemy team. So, looking at it from that perspective, then yeah, of course, it's like very good. I like I don't hate off bones. I just don't like the fact that you buy it on every hero. That's all. That is all. Pop, pop. Uh, there's no VOD for the KC game because the replay is dead. You bird, 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 you my tower. Yeah, bitch. Edoc. Alright, I'm gonna stop cursing Thai people. I'm sorry, Kutu. It's just funny when they're like. Yeah, yeah it's just funny. Here was a quick recap of how the game worked. Uh, I was on Balfagor. Uh, Moss was on Wild Soul. We had. Uh, I destroyed my lane in the way that. with the help of my two supports, so that Bubbles got no experience at all, while our hero was able to get a little bit. So we had an off lane that got uh, experience, while their off lane didn't get anything at all. Uh, and then we had Midas versus Pebbles mid. Tons was winning his lane until he got ganked, and then Pebbles ended up with getting quite decent farm anyway. Ultimately though, I was a 500 GPM short lane Balfagor, and my Walsall was free farming our jungle, and they didn't have the power to enter our jungle. And then we had Fade, who's OP, and he just found kills and won us again. And at the point of, what, 20 minutes, I was 480 GPM or so, my Walsall was 600, we got Congor, got one Rax, game over. It wasn't a very active game, we just outfarmed them the whole game. And then the game ended, pretty much. <laughs> hey, Gax! What you doing? I come, I come. No, 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 no. My, my, my. Okay. So yeah, that, that's like a long story short. So, long story short, we had Fade, Fade's OP. Our lanes made us get more experience. We had a Wild Soul and a Balfour free farming. They had didn't have that much counter push besides the Bubbles. And Bubbles was level 1 by like 5 minutes, so he couldn't counter push me bottom. And yeah, we won the game. Nope, does not mean we're in the World Finals at all. We still have free games to go to win this qualifier and if we do win of course and um, then I don't know how they're gonna shrink four teams to two I don't know like I said anyway uh, alright